I'm in Chiang Mai, Thailand, about to head out to a field site four and a half hours to the west, near the Thai-Myanmar border. And it's inside this national park uh, that a team of American Thai Bhutanese researchers are studying uh, the effectiveness of some community fish conservation zones that have been established here. So this is a pretty remote area. The last few weeks these guys have been fishing here trying to catch fish, catch these big masir species uh, in order to tag them with radio tags to understand how they're moving around these fish conservation zones. So this is Ban Melui and this is the first reserve that was set up in this whole area uh, about 25 years ago and they've got a such section of river that's about 900 meters long and one of the some of the largest fish uh, probably the highest densities of fish that we see in this whole area is, is in this stretch here extending about 600 meters up that way and then 300 more meters down below us where we are right now i surveyed 23 of the reserves inside and outside doing all snorkel surveys and then collected data on um, so fish diversity abundance estimated biomass for inside the reserve and outside the reserve and then also got information from the communities on how old the reserve was, if they ever fished that reserve. So some of the communities will close the reserve for three years and then fish it intensively for like three days, one year, close it again for the next three years or next five years or next seven years. <laughs> and you see higher densities, uh, how many species? Five to, 500 to 10,000 baht is the fine. So I, in this village, the first offense is 500, the third offense is 10,000 is the way that it works. So. Um, and then I think it also goes by the number of fish that you catch. Pretty easy. 